Hey, welcome. I got some Dollar Bin books that I picked up and one or two new comic book day ones. And I got some Mayo, a new comic book that I picked up uh, from Lone Star Comics. So check out what I got here. But first, I'm going to go through the do dollar bins that we got. Or the dollar bin finds that we got. I think I picked up 36 books uh, from uh, PBS Comics. Uh, they have the deal where it's buy uh, get 12 for ten dollars so picked up a few a lot of these are going to be books that i am going to be reselling on my whatnot channel or whatnot stream so please check that out uh, i have comic issues just like the channel name but the first one i got for you and got these all for uh 12 for ten dollars or about 88 cents a piece got avengers issue 217 Pretty cool Avengers cover there. Got Avengers issue 284. Another sharp one there. We've got a lot of glare going on there. There. Avengers 284. There we go. Got Avengers issue 291. Yeah, I think this is a really cool kick-ass Ronin cover here. New Avengers issue number 13. And got Avengers issue number 324. Yeah. Avengers issue 321. Pretty cool. And we got Avengers issue 296. Pretty cool right there also. All right. They had some old new comic book day or uh, free comic book day uh, books. So I picked up a couple from my grandkids. Got some granddaughters that like Monster High. So I got those. Uh, got some grandsons. I think they might like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So I picked up two copies of that. And then I picked up the uh, free comic book day Absolute Power right there. So that was pretty cool. But those were the free comic book day books I picked up from a while back. But let's get back to the uh, uh, dollar bin stuff. Avengers issue 294. Then I got Uncanny X-Men issue 10. Pretty cool Archangel cover there. I like that one a lot. A lot. X-Men Gold issue number 29. Set these aside. Next one I got is Heroes for Hope, X-Men issue number one. Just a pretty cool cover there. I like it a lot. Right. Got Uncanny X-Men issue 306. Excalibur issue number 20. Excalibur issue number 29. They're all pretty, pretty nice looking covers here. I uh, got new Excalibur issue number three right there. Uh, some more uh, free comic book day, those stuck there in the middle. Got two copies of uh, Ultimate Spider Man or Spider Man Ultimate Universe. And then picked up. Uh, Arkham Asylum, spoof of Arkham, Arkham Asylum for the crazy pets. And then, I don't know, this one just looked interesting. So I picked that copy up also. Let's save these for a minute later. Got Excalibur issue number 26. Excalibur issue number five. West Coast Avengers annual issue number one. And West Coast Avengers annual issue number two. Those are all pretty cool. I like those a lot.
You got new Avengers issue number 15. Spider Woman on the cover there. Avengers issue number 62 or Legacy issue 477. Avengers issue 265, Secret War 2 crossover. Uh, got a Red Sonia issue number one. I do not know the variant of this one, but Red Sonia, I think this would be a good one to, to have for my whatnot stream. So that's why I picked that one up. And got Red Sonia issue number zero. All of these dollar bin books I'm going to have in my whatnot, uh, upcoming whatnot stream. So please uh, click on the link below. If you're not on whatnot already, please do uh, join through my link and you'll get uh, $15 off your uh, first purchase. Uh, this is Uncanny X-Men issue uh, 496. It's either 15 or it's 10, but you get a discount, you get a deal. So you should check it out. Uncanny X-Men issue 302. And Uncanny X-Men issue 303. These are all pretty cool. I like them a lot. Everybody lo loves X-Men, or most people do. Yeah, I got some Incredible Hulk, or some Hulk. I got Indestructible Hulk, issue number 16. Really like that effect in his eyes there, the atomic bomb, or gamma bomb. Uh, Hulk, issue number 15. Yep, Hulk, issue number 15. Incredible Hulk, issue number five, right there. Focus. All right. Incredible Hulk issue number 51. That's just a scary cover. Incredible Hulk issue number 53. Incredible Hulk 710. Incredible Hulk 623. Incredible Hulk 709. Had some people in my past uh, whatnot show that really liked the, the Hulk and stuff like that, so that's why I'm picking these up. Uh, and got Incredible Hulk issue number 57 right there. All right, so those are all the dollar bins books I picked up. And like I said, that was 36 books. I paid $30 for them, so got them about 88 cents a piece. I did pick up a couple of books off of the rack. Picked up a Scarlet issue number four right there. Pretty cool Storm Shadow Scarlet cover. Uh, got that one. Got Rook Exodus issue number five. I think this is cover A. Um, my other source for comics, I think they had already sold out of this one. Uh, so I picked this one up from TBS. So that was Rook Exodus issue number five. Um, my other choice that I purchased uh, my comic books from is from my local online LCS, uh, Ron's Comic Closet, which is also a sponsor of this channel. If, and if you use code I have issues uh, at checkout on your first purchase, you'll get 20% off your entire first purchase. And then he also has deals going forward on just regular purchases. I think if you buy five or more, you might get 15% off. Uh, so check out Ron's Comic Closet. Link will be down down below in the description and the last book i picked up is space ghost issue number five i think that's a pretty kick-ass cover there space ghost issue number five so these are all the books that i picked up from tbs the other day so really happy with all that and the last thing i got to do is open up this uh mail that i got from my uh, lone star comics uh so let's do that And these are three, three copies of the same book I picked up. I kind of got these to do and or sell one or two of them and maybe an upcoming whatnot uh, show. I thought they were pretty cool. It also is my favorite character. All right, so it's three covers here. 
or three of the same books, but it is Wolverine number one, the negative space uh, copy from J. Tyler Christopher, I believe. Or let me check. Yeah, John Tyler Christopher, a negative space variant of Wolverine number one. I think that is really freaking awesome. So that is one of my new favorite covers of all my covers. Wolverine number one, negative space variant. Awesome. Just freaking awesome. Love it. Um, well, these are the books that I picked up this week uh, from the Dower Bins, from some of the off the rack stuff, and the special order from uh, Lone Star Comics or My Comic Shop. Sorry, mycomicshop.com. I apologize. Uh, but these are the books that I picked up. I will try to put the FMV down below, all the ones that I showed you. Uh, yeah. Thank you very much. If you haven't already, please uh, like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what you think of all these. And I know that I have issues, comic book issues, and just like you do. So uh, please check out some of my other videos right here. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye.